What's up guys, it's Unseen and I'm here in New York City. I'm going to answer a couple of interview questions for Andrew Jean Audio, so let's get into it. It's actually a funny story because back in university, the parties that they had was only country music or jazz music. I wanted to go out and hear different kind of music, so instead of going to these venues, I started throwing my own parties in college. I was DJing mostly trance, dubstep, uh, hip hop. Then my college roommate he started listening to techno. I actually hated techno in the beginning, but over time of him always listening to it in um, our dorm room, it grew on me. So ever since then, I started producing and DJing techno, and the rest is history. I'm actually pretty young in terms of producer years. I actually started producing music about two years ago. I was all about energy and in New York City, Manhattan is all about vocals and, and energy. So I started producing tech house music. It's only recently that I started melodic techno. That's when Unseen uh, formed. So my music definitely has a lot of vocals and it still has the energy of Tech House, but it has a big melodic feel to it as well. Some of my favorite labels are Afterlife Records, uh, Oddity, Embassy One, Rose Avenue. So moving forward, I really want to work on EPs and a lot of collaborations, adding a little bit more vocals because the vocals is what makes them really unique. I'm working on a lot more tracks coming up with collaborations with a lot more artists. My music is very melodic, emotional, and dancing. I only select a few artists. I listen to the instruments that they use, the patterns and percussions. I try to emulate it or model the sounds. And a lot of the times you won't know how to make these sounds, but as you're experimenting and trying to uh, replicate the sound, you'll discover new techniques and new ways that will make your song actually really unique. I would literally try to just find a few artists listen to their sounds, try to replicate it or model it however you can. Over time, you'll figure it out. It'll make your sounds really, really unique. I really use Diva a lot, Serum uh, a lot for the bass line, some synth patterns, The Legend, Salinth One, and also Arturia. So those are the five VSTs and plugins that I use. 